welcome to the in this tutorial i am going to show you to install the uh, centos 7 is the latest version in the virtual box that i am going to show you and uh, here is the link where you can download the virtual box this is the website of virtual box you can see on the screen and uh, you need it's having the version 5.1.2 because the version which and this windows supported you can download and install OS, Mac, Linux, Solaris. And this is actually the action where you can find the supported and you can download. So after download and install the virtual box, you need to download this CentOS. This you can search in the Google by typing CentOS download. Once you type, open that link and here is the direct link is there. CentOS.org/download is there. And this thing you can see this is the website of the CentOS is there. You can download the PDF. Or everything or my IOC image is there. So once you all you can download from the torrent also is there. Verify here yeah, you can see on the screen and uh, support for the AWS also it support. And, uh, scroll you can find for the older version also is there. And let's uh, the download by clicking here DVD IOC image. And this will be here is actual country supported where you can download this nearby. So this is having the seven version. If you can click any of this link, it will be a pop up will become with a so image installation. And like on the screen, you can see this is having the GP version seven, and this is a 64 bit ISO image. I have download and and please remember this 32 bit now supported. So you can see on the screen all are supported 64 bit only. This and you can see scroll down to. In this way, once you download this uh, IOS image, show you how to install it. And this is my website, itpodnet.blogspot.in it is the best website. And uh, you can find uh, in this website about the uh, programming like Python, Google, all the social media, Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram, YouTube, and uh, and how to like to CentOS, Linux, Mint, Deepin, MyOS. This is CCNA and the smartphone comes to Android, iOS, Windows tips. And they, I have been on Jenny channel watching Hindi also. You can find her. And this is you can also join to the cloud network also. And here is a tutorial which I have been make, making here. And uh, here which I have been uh, make like I am showing you the Linux also MCSC. This is uh, what I have been making. When it comes to X, you can see you can find the full course training tutorial is there. Like that here you can see like basic command user interface. All this are you can find it here. And once you click any of these links, you can become here. With a screenshot you can see. And uh, if you have any problem, you can comment and below my video also. So just to open the virtual box and click to new and type CentOS 7 and just click select your 64 bit or 32 bit next and assign the ram at the green point next. next and this is the name actually the same name and this is the size for the installation i am giving 30 gb it support maximum and also it depends on your hard disk size also and this is a location where it is going to store in your uh, desktop server or the laptop where you are installing that one you can change the location also so click now and it put settings here and then in the system uncheck copy and then click on storage click on empty and then choose your iso image where you have downloaded the uh, cent my center is iso image i have been downloaded just assign that one click network and select the bridge adapter only after selecting the bridge you just have to don't do anything here to the next options click on ok just click to ok and click to start now on the screen you can see uh, i have been have the two options like install center 7 test this media troubleshoot just select the Install CentOS Linux from the keyboard app and arrow by selecting that options. Press and enter. So on the screen, you need to select uh, 
welcome to the centers next seven select the language which you want to uh, language prefer language after selecting your language just to the uh, point continue once you you can also search your language and then click to continue uh, and we came on the important part of the uh, part the uh, installation summary actually by default the time zone had been selected the wrong and i am going to select the correct time zone you can select from here also just click done and the keyboard and the language support also correct and the installation source so is correct this one software selection is also correct just we need to change the installation type check this box and just click ok done you can also do the manual also installation so once you scroll down there is options for manual kw is ok internet is not connected just select on that one or off that one so after on that one select here you can set the security like you can see this is a security policy of ios just i am skipping that one you can select that policy and uh, we are going to continue with that installation now i'm clicking on begin the installation and we need to set the password here and uh, please remember this password and you need to give a strong password mix characters like characters special symbols you need to give for the root password so remember that password i'm creating a new user this cloud network and you can give any name user name for logging purpose i am giving it and you can make this administrator also i'm making this administrator giving the password please give a strong password and please remember that password also which i'm saying you need to make a strong password jumble characters special words you need to use special characters you need to use for the password and it may take few minutes to complete the installations On the screen, you can see the installation has been completed. Now I'm going to just to reboot now. Just select the first option and press and enter. So on the screen, you can see this is the welcome, and I'm going to log in with my username and just press and enter. We ask the password. Type the password on the screen. You can see the version. The new version is also there, 64 bit. Apart from that, I see the installations has been completed. Let's type the RC architecture. And you can see the architecture also. You type cat slash pro. the information about the memory as well so <clears throat> in this way uh, you can see the update so this is the installation of centos actually and if you have any problem you can comment below my video thanks for watching my video please subscribe